Well, I got friends in law. The music of Garth Brooks rang out at Croke Park today. Not the man himself, mind, not yet anyway, but from one of his biggest fans and tribute act, who's delighted with the prospect of the singer's return. I had my tickets, same as everybody else, for the last show, so please God, him coming back would be a great night, and it'll also give me and my band a lift too. It's now seven years since the infamous licensing row resulted in the country star cancelling five shows at the stadium. Today, local reps said they're in the dark as to whether he'll be hitting the stage here next September. So we haven't really uh, heard anything from Co Park. Well, I suppose Crow Park have uh, a license for three concerts. Um, you know, uh, five concerts is something that you know I, I would imagine that the residents uh, would wouldn't be very very happy with and would probably object to. Today, organisers were keeping quiet as residents in the area had their say. Bit of a surprise as a resident because uh, we haven't heard anything from Crow Park about this. Not five, absolutely no way. I mean, three nights is enough. Yeah, no, no, it's very honest, it doesn't bother me. I'm too long living here to worry about who plays over there and who doesn't. Well, let's put it this way, I'm 50 years here. So I'm 50 years looking at matches. No, it doesn't bother me. When Garth Brooks was due to play here last time out, it caused an often bitter debate. No doubt those behind it this time around will hope the rancour is not repeated. For the moment, though, it's all TBC. And I'll be okay. Connor Hunt, RTE News.